Hello, Bond. Dr. Neutrino, I presume. Yes, it is I, Dr. Neutrino, your evil arch-enemy. Welcome to my secret underground lair, located miles beneath the Earth's surface. Only accessible by a secret panel inside Grand Central Station. Just beneath the Cinnabon. Now, Bond! You're trapped down here. The mass stolen nuclear bomb ticks down to zero. You won't be alone down here, of course. Guards! Bond? Bond? Still alive, Bond? Still. So be it. Come and find me. Then we'll see whose shoes on the other foot. <laughs> Bond! Dr. Neutrino! This is your secret underground lair? Yeah, the, the movie went a bit over budget with the big car chase scene, so they had to skimp on the underground lair. It's, it's pretty lame, isn't it? Yes, it looks like they just used some guy's basement apartment. They did. Can you believe people actually live like this? <laughs> Poor people. <laughs> Poor people. <laughs> Don't change the subject. We've got a huge anti-climax right here. We can't end the movie like this in some rat's ass apartment. When people watch one of my movies, they want to see supercomputers and vats of acid and tunnels. Lots and lots of tunnels. They, they have a fish tank. And does the fish tank have sharks in it? No, no, no. It's, it's a little tropical fish. His, his name is Tony. Hello, Tony. I see. So you still want to finish the movie? Not really. Oh, come on, we can do this. It doesn't have to be a complete disaster. C come on, you're in the bad guy's lair. It's the end of the movie. There's a nuclear bomb ticking down to zero. Oh, yes, the bomb. Where is the bomb? It's, uh, it's uh, off screen. Off screen. So the studio is too cheap to build a simple prop. And this is a tent pole. Look, the studio cuts the budget during production. What do you want me to do? Look, look, look. I did the maths. We can go back and shoot this scene right if you're willing to take a 1% pay cut. That'll pay for everything. A 1% pay cut? Yeah. Let's just use this set. I like this set. Whatever you say, cheap bastard. What was that? Nothing. And uh, let's just finish this. Huh? Everybody wake up. We're going to fight now. They've probably all walked out of the theater by now. Right. Bond. James Bond. Do you always have to do that? Contractual obligation. We really got fucked on this one, didn't we? Ah! Oh! Oh! Ah! And we couldn't afford a better fight director. Ow! Oh! Forget it, forget it, you can drop your character. The movie's over. Ow, oh, my balls! I said cut, okay? Do you understand? Cut. That really hurt, asshole. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to. Call 911. Is it really that bad? I think I lost the testicle. I, I'm sure they'll find it in here somewhere. I've got zero bars. Oh, fucking basement apartment. Use the phone in the kitchen. They still use a landline? Go! Sorry. Uh, at least this isn't Quantum of Solace. Now that was a piece of crap. And what was with that awful Scottish accent you were doing? I'm doing Sean Connery. Not very well. Fuck you. Fuck you. Wing that's all.